Well, after fiddling with it for quite some time, I was able to finally get the uh, touchscreen working on the uh, Blue Life XL in the Team Win Recovery Project. And uh, I made a little video here just showing uh, showing it working. And, um, you know, you can take a second just to check that out. And then we'll talk about, more importantly, what we did to uh, to make that function. So as you can see, the uh, touchscreen working there. Uh, just at this point in the video, I'm bringing up the Get Props so you can take a look and see that it is, in fact, the uh, Blue Life XL. Well, great. So the more important question is, what did I end up doing to make that function? Well, uh, that's a good question. And uh, so we've been using uh, Mini Team Win Recovery Project uh, from the uh, the GitHub there, um, downloading those. And that way, it allows us just to not have to download all of Android to uh, build something from source. <coughs> but what I ended up doing uh, is before I was using Mini uh, Team Win Recovery Project, uh, for Omni, and particularly on 5.1, because that's what the kernel was of this particular device, um, and that just made sense to me as something to do. Unfortunately, I could never make the touchscreen work uh, in that uh, in that uh, Team Win Recovery project for Mini Omni, and so what I ended up doing was using the Mini uh, Lineage um, tree instead. And uh, so I did have to do some device changes. Um, we do, I do have another series about uh, upgrading the Blue Life XL from Lollipop to Marshmallow to Nugget to um, Oreo. And uh, that'll be a really interesting series to look at. Um, however, I uh, just wanted to show that uh, I ended up using the tree that I was utilizing for the lineage uh, model to get the touchscreen to work properly, and I ended up using the Mini Twerp 4 lineage to make that work. So my device tree has changed pretty significantly um, over over time. Uh, a lot of material being added, but of course this is the material that's used primarily for uh, building a full version of lineage. Uh, nugget, and so um, it's interesting just that I couldn't make the touchscreen work as it was, but it should have worked. And uh, then when I just went ahead and fleshed out the rest of the tree and uh, did it in, even fleshing out the rest of the tree didn't seem to solve the problem in Omni Team Win Recovery Project. I ended up having to build it from inside of Lineage to make that work. And so that's just one of those weird situations that you might run into something like that. I thought I'd go ahead and include it here in the video. Um, why does that why does that work instead of the other way? I don't really know why, I'll be honest. Um, it should have worked. The only thing I can think of is uh, Team Win Recovery Project has uh, kind of a much more robust um, uh, hardware section, and uh, perhaps this, uh, this helped in some way, shape, or form. But uh, again, I can't really see anything in particular that would have helped out with that. Uh, the touchscreen driver should be based entirely off of the kernel. And so I don't know why uh, that didn't build properly with uh, with Omni Team Win Recovery Project and why it does work with uh, Lineage Team Win Recovery Project. Um, once again, the Team Win Recovery Project is the same for both. Uh, that's just a folder, uh, really, that's inside of this uh, bootable section here. And you have this recovery folder. And that is going to be the same for Omni or Lineage wherever you put that Team Win Recovery Project folder at. Um, but I think really what made the difference was stepping it up to 14.1 or uh, Nougat instead of, uh, instead of using Lollipop sources. And I'm not really sure why that is. I should have been able to make it work on Lollipop, but I couldn't. And so it was nice to get it fixed in uh, Nougat. So hopefully uh, you found that interesting, and uh, I'll try to provide links also as well. I made it available for download if anybody happens to have a Blue Life XL and they want to check it out. I'll try to remember to post that link in the description below. So thank you very much.